All right, so if you want to become an absolute unit in your agency, smoke all your competitors, overall just not be this guy, you're gonna to wanna to invest about eight minutes of your time here. It's not gonna kill you. I will show you what actually works after four and a half years of my agency of pretty much just pure pain and suffering on my road to fully automating my agency. And there are six things here. So get your notebook out, let's roll. So becoming an absolute unit in your SMMA. Number one, chicken. SMMA is literally just one big game of chicken. And if you chicken out, you lose, period. Like it's strange, but it's actually that simple at the same time. Like when things get hard, when there are things you don't wanna do, whatever the case may be, because things are inevitably going to become challenging for you, if you chicken out, you lose, or you at least lose points, and then you start downward spiraling into failure, into wanting to quit, into whatever else there is. So there's a hard conversation, there's this, there's that, that you don't wanna do, you're afraid to cold call. You can chicken out, but sucks to be you, you're not gonna make it anywhere, right? So it's, it's really just, if you look at it as grossly simplified as a game of chicken, this will actually help you. Now, on the difficulty conversation, which goes hand in hand with this whole game of chicken, SMA, is, I, I mentioned in the beginning, like there was a lot of pain and suffering in my agency just to get it to be fully automated. Okay, like it's not an easy game. You look at video games, right? Like look at the top 1% players, just the sweatiest nerds. These guys don't touch grass, okay? These guys, look at how many hours they have in the game. 6,000 hours, 10,000 hours in the game, 10,000 hours. One year full-time in your business, full-time is only 2,080 hours if you're working 40 hours per week. A lot of guys are working 60 hours per, per week like me. A lot of guys even do more than that and push 80 and 100 plus. And if you want to compete on this level, you have to play the game the same way that people on these levels are playing the game. It's really hard, man. Like you have to give up a lot of things just to make this work at the levels that you actually want to. 100K per month, 200K per month, 400K per month. Now, it will inevitably get hard to a point where you want to quit or it, the, the thought enters your mind. You, a lot of you watching this has pro have probably already experienced this. It is a fact of being in this game starting out, especially when you come in with zero skills. You're sitting there, people are doubting you, you're starting to doubt yourself. You're like, why am I even doing this? Should I be doing something else? You might be looking at job boards, whatever the case may be. So when things get hard, one solution to that, to make sure that you keep playing, because really SMMA and entrepreneurship in general is a game of outlasting other people and making it through the hard things that they don't wanna go through. But one key thing here is to remind yourself in these moments, this is why people quit and just remind yourself that it's a game of chicken. It's a game of outlasting. Remind yourself again, this is why people quit and you'll be well on your way to becoming a tank. So on a similar note, there are gonna be hard things I mentioned that you'll wanna, or not that you'll wanna do, that you have to do that you really don't wanna do. You really don't wanna do. It could be a hard conversation with an upset client, picking up the phone and making a call and you might be really nervous, especially if you're on the introverted side of the spectrum like me, right? Some some people just have sales anxiety in general. That was a really big problem for me starting out. So to get through this, when you're in these moments, there one thing that you can do is just literally ask yourself, well, what am I going to do? Not do it. Am I just going to chicken out? What am I going to do? Not take the sales call, not make the difficult client call that I have to make, not fire the person and just let everything fall apart. If you use this frame of mind, and especially if you tie it to this identity of being a chicken, this makes you act right. Because you know, looking at this, you know, it, it's not just a game of chicken. Like, like, people don't only quit because they're, like, chickening out. Don't get me wrong. But, like, that can be a big part of it. And it's like, well, how bad do you even want to do this thing? You need some, like, deep underlying motivator to push you every day. Um, and, and tying a negative behavior to a negative identity can enforce a positive behavior that gets tied to a positive identity like becoming an absolute unit. So moving on to tryharding. Again, we've seen all the, the sweaty tryhards in video games, the guys who just like, they have no life. They're always online. They have like 150 hours past two weeks on Steam or something like that. 
these guys, they're tryharding like crazy. In school, you half-ass because like, what's the reward? Oh, good job. You should be getting good marks. You should be happy. It's like, dude, you get paid to try hard here. You get paid to try hard. Now, the money takes a while to come in, and we'll get into that in a second, but you are literally getting paid to just be a sweaty nerd at a game. It's like a prof SMMA is like a professional sport. You have to play like crazy. You need thousands of hours. You need to be living and breathing it to make it to these crazy, crazy high levels. And a lot of people just simply underestimate what it actually takes. And then I was talking about, you know, it takes some time for all this to work and for you to get the Lambo. Like, honestly, the, the percentage of people that start an agency and two years later, you know, they're able to buy a Lambo in cash and have it be a responsible financial decision is so incredibly slim. It is ridiculous. It is insane. It's probably not going to happen to you. Can it happen to you? Absolutely. I'm not here to crush your dreams. I'm here to promote your dreams. I'm here to give you the realistic approach to your dreams because this is the realistic approach to your dreams. It's a game of chicken. It's really hard. There are a lot of reasons people quit and there are a lot of things you're going to have to do that you don't want to do. You have to try hard to really get to the levels you want to get to and it's going to take you way longer than you think it's going to take and you're going to be sitting there like, dude, when can I please just bank hard? And it will take you years. It will literally take you years, oftentimes five to seven plus. Seriously, like it's not an easy game. Now, talent has has a play in this. If you're very talented, then you're lucky just out of the gate and you can actually uh, be ahead of the, the spectrum if you implement all of this. I don't, I have some talents in business. I have, I, I don't have some talents in business. Everybody's kind of the same way, but it, depending on where you're talented and where you're not, like you may need to hustle harder than everybody else just to get where you want to go. But regardless, if you want to hit these million per month, like crazy, crazy numbers, like I do, the, the work it takes is, is just wild. Like I can't even tell you how many hours deep I am in, in just online business as a whole right now. I'm probably nearing 10,000 hours and I am not nearly as well off as I thought I would be. Seriously. Like, it's just a hard game, straight up. So like, can you get the Lambo? 100%. Can I buy a nice car right now? Can I buy a supercar? Yes, I can buy a supercar, but it'd be kind of stupid. I don't want to buy something unless it's like 5% of my net worth. That's just kind of how I am. I'm, I'm a lot tighter with money than a lot of people are. Um, but regardless, this is really how you become just nuts, just completely nutty in your agency. It's not easy. It doesn't happen overnight. This is the real roadmap. If you want to work with me personally and have me help you kind of fast track your way, I'm not here to tell you you're going to make a million dollars overnight because listen to everything I just told you, but there are faster ways. And I seriously wished I had a mentor earlier on. I wish I paid for a mentor earlier on, but I didn't because I was too afraid, right? And that actually ended up holding me back a lot. If you want to work with me personally, there's a sales call link in the description. You can book in, have a chat with me. We can talk about whether or not it makes sense. Otherwise, click whatever's popping up on screen now, and I'll see you there.